Sad news now, celebrity hairdresser Trevor Sorby has died just a few weeks after revealing on ITV's This Morning that he had terminal cancer. The 75-year-old was famed for creating the Wedge Cut and in later years set up a medical hair loss charity which helped cancer patients and people with alopecia. A spokesperson for his salon said he passed away surrounded by his family and his beloved dog, Harry Davis, on the tribute and his legacy. It's the 1980s and being highly skilled with a pair of scissors can earn you fame and fortune. Trevor Sorby is considered one of today's foremost international hair designers. As he told this 1986 documentary, his journey from his dad's barbershop boy to hairstylist superstar began by accident. Through a sequence of events, I left school quite abruptly and um, my father sort of said to me, basically, would you like to help me while you find another job? Sorby created The Wedge in 1974, the first haircut to earn a double-page spread in vogue. And it's still recreated by hairdressers around the world today. He opened his flagship Covent Garden salon in 1979. It's now one of six in the UK. And his talent will live on in those he taught. He has nurtured so much talent and so many other hairdressers in the industry more than like more than anybody else. And that's just because he, you know, he loved teaching. He was particularly proud of his charity, My New Hair. It provides wig styling advice for people suffering from cancer. There's a great thing about synthetic wigs. He revealed his own terminal cancer diagnosis on this morning last month. And I looked at Carol and she looked at me and we were both speechless, we were just walking down the road. <laughs> like, I didn't know what to say. He leaves behind an impact on the industry that earned him an MBE in 2004. He was the first hairdresser to be awarded one. There are probably not many hairdressers in the United Kingdom that aren't cutting or colouring hair tomorrow on a busy Saturday that won't be in some way using the techniques that he influenced Trevor Sorby didn't want a funeral, so his team says there won't be one. His advice to them, be bold, be different, but always do everything in good taste. Our tributes to Trevor Sorby, who has died at the age of 75.